sitting six foot of water here. Just out in front of me, there's like, uh, we passed through about 11 foot. Okay, we'll put one tiny leech on once. I've got some really cool, some really small ones in here. And we'll throw that line with the bobber. Nice wet line. Not bad for the first cast. And he swallowed it. Let's see what we got for size on it. Fourteen and fourteen and a quarter. <laughs> yeah, that's nice. Good first cast. My bobber's down with the small minnow or small leech on it. Oh, yeah, nice. Another walleye. Another nice walleye. about the same size. Hey. Fourteen and a half. That one's fourteen and a half. Pretty shallow down there. He's hanging right below the boat. <laughs> Guess I should probably get some bait on these, or some hooks on these poles. <laughs> I got two poles that don't have any bait on. Okay, we got this other line that's been sitting out here for quite a while. So we still got one that needs a hook on it. But I don't want to leave this one sitting out there too long because it's a fish have been are biting pretty good right now. Nice thing is the sun's not even hit the horizon yet. Usually that's when they start biting. So I'm glad I came out here early. We're gonna get that other pull back out there with the bobber on it. Keep marking small fish coming through. Holy cow. My line just went running. Which one was it? Which one? This one. <laughs> Line just went screaming out. Uh, and then there's nothing. 
wonder if he took my bait. Oh, there it goes again. Must be swimming towards me. That's just weird. Yeah, it's like the line went screaming out and then there was just nothing. Unless it's really swimming towards me and I'm just... Oh, it is. It's swimming towards me. Okay, there we go. Oh, wow. Okay. It's got some weight to it. It's going to jump. Ah, my reel. I tried to fix it. Oh, it's got some weight to it. That's a big fish. What is it? Monster. <laughs> I think it was a monster smallmouth. Bit my line. Oh, wow. That was, it was. Hopefully, the camera picked it up. That. <laughs> That's not to make it easy to tie a hook. Oh, wow. I'm shaking like a leaf. Oh. Big fish, wow. Oh, I wish I would have got him in the boat. <sighs> Bit the line. I don't know if he... I'm I'm gonna save smallmouth. It could have been a walleye though. It it was had a pretty light colored side, but I know smallmouth bass are pretty light colored sides too. Some of them. There's another bite. Okay, we've got another one. Oh, 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 oh. Just missed him. Got some weight. I don't know if this is a fish or if it's the bottom. Thinking snake. Oh, no, 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 not snake. Not snake. Are we, oh, 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 no. Okay. Oh, it was like, it just started running. Felt like a log. Oh, wait a minute, it's still there. It's still there. This one's been sitting for a little while. That's why I like using three poles, because then while you're working with the two, the third one is sitting for quite a long time.
turn the camera off for half a second. My bobber went down right when I did. Can't get it to... Oh, come on. It's swimming towards me is what it's doing. Yeah, it's coming right at me. There we go. What do we got? Landing it. What do we got here? Smallmouth. I'm thinking that's probably what it was that I had on the other one. Smallmouth. Oh. Yeah, it's probably what we had was that big, it was a big smallmouth. Oh, I think I might have something going on both my other lines. So I think we're going to have to wait on the, getting a new hook on there. Yep, I do have something going on this one. Sunset, it's beautiful. I guess I don't have anything going on that one right now. This line looks like it's straight down. Let's get back out there. It's a little bit smaller leech on this one, so that might be one of the reasons why. We'll check this one and then we'll get that new hook on that one. Yeah, it was a. Oh, it was straight down. Huh. There we go. Line just took off running. I turned my camera off for half a second. Yep, there's something good on there. Something going. Oh, man. Felt like he... Must have had the tip of the leech in his mouth. Yeah, didn't quite have the leech in his mouth totally. I hadn't come out to this spot to this year yet. And this was growing up. This is one of our, this was always one of our go-to spots. Every night. Oh, shoot. I think I got something going on that other line again. Gonna, I'm not gonna be able to get this hook tight and tight. I don't think. Okay, let's. Yeah, we'll. Oh, we keep getting. We're losing depth every time we get a fish because. So let's just. We're gonna put the bobber up just. Get a little extra depth to it. Oh, that leech is swimming really good. Put it right out there. Yeah, it's a good spot. Okay, let's see what we got here. Oh, let's, okay, we, we already did, that one was the one that was just in a little bit ago, so let's grab this ball. Sun just hit the horizon. That's amazing, beautiful. Okay. Oh, there we go. What side do we got our this other line? 
over under this other line, so try to move it. So I can see the weeds right here. It's only you know five and a half, six foot water. But I'm not getting any weeds. Because the fish are just hitting so much so quick. It's not giving them a chance to put down in the into the weeds. Okay, this one is Yeah, we're under our bobber pole. Let's move the bobber pole. Oh wow, we're just marking a ton of fish right here. Oh yeah, yep, we got a fish going. Got a fish going. Oh, I think he just grabbed the end of the leech. This is playing with it. Yeah, you're just playing with it. This is that little bitty leech, so I probably should change it, but let's check the pull. It looked like it was running out. Just be safe. Yeah, yeah, a little weight. Could be just playing with it again. Yes, there's something playing with it. It's like I don't want to let it swallow it, but it's the way it's just playing with it. It's not taking it all the way into his mouth. There we go. Okay, that's. Another little walleye. Yeah. A school of like a school of fourteen inches it looks like. Okay. Another one? Oh good, this guy's just see just in the lip, that's the way I want it. Was that's why he's not without getting bit. Oh, he's got my, I don't know if you can see that, he's got my other leech in his mouth. Let's see, let's see if he is. Mm, 13 three quarter or 12 and three quarters. Okay, well, I got my other leech back. Oh, I hate that I lost him. Didn't even get a chance to... Oh, wait a minute. Here we go. It's just, he was so close. We could have just got a little bit closer. I could have seen him. Oh, wow. It felt like a... Almost felt like a bluegill bite. Just like a pop, pop, pop. Yeah, it's doing it again. There he goes. Whoa. Hey, speaking of... Yeah, be what it is. Little bluegill. Well, not real small, but nice little bluegill. Yeah. Okay. Let's get this one on that way. More off the back of the boat. I think we got something going on this one. Yep, we got something going on this one. We just uh, just threw this one out. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh, <laughs> made something jump.
think we're getting caught in some weeds. Another nice walleye. Oh, let's see. It's a little bit longer. Let's see what is. How long is he? Oh, he's like. Let's see. Just 15. Yeah, we're gonna. Yeah, we'll give him the hook, even though we're gonna keep him. Okay. 15 inch. Nice. Okay. That's what we like to see. The net going in the water. There's a really good chance that that was a walleye that I had on. It'll be good to take a look closer on the video. Might be able to zoom in on it and see exactly what we had. But uh, I'm saying it's a smallmouth, so I don't feel quite as bad. <laughs> Even though I still feel bad about it. But oh, we got some fireworks going on. I don't know if you'll be able to see them. not going up very high okay if this is a fish it's a big one could be a snag though there are snags here even though I haven't been getting any yeah that was a snag there's some little fish starting to hit the surface around the boat too yep yep got a little bit of weed on there I think my we're gonna be able to see them. Some beautiful cloud formations tonight. Wow. It's a little bit bigger fish this one under the boat. Oh, it's nine o'clock. I gotta get heading in. I'm not even gonna bother putting a hook on this one right now. I'll do it when I get back in. I don't like to stay out much past nine because if the boat doesn't want to start, I gotta be able to have a little daylight to row in. I'm marking a lot of fish right now. Let's see if I can. No, now they're not working. <laughs> Figures. Go down to show the camera and they stop marking. Mosquito. Mosquito just buzzed my ear. So that's another sign. To start getting ready to head in. Yes. There we go. We'll keep the fish floating until we get this last pole in. Okay. Now let's get the fish in, get the boat going. See the weeds right through here hitting the surface.
There's the 15 inch that I caught tonight. All cleaned up and in the pan, ready to cook. It's two slabs of real butter. Here, start to sizzle. It won't take very long once the butter is melted. Let's go on one side for a little while and then we'll flip them over. Okay, yeah, it's almost completely done even just on the one side. It's not very thick. Twisted, so twist, turn one side, the other side flips back the other way. Oh, let's do that. Let it go for a little bit longer. Okay, it's been on long enough. Let me turn the heat off. We're pretty much done. One thing I noticed when I came in, we brought a lot of mosquitoes in with us, and they've been flocking to over the pan for some reason, which worked out good because then I used my mosquito fly swatter zapper thingy and got rid of them. So I think we're about, about done with the fish and about ready to get I'm just gonna eat it like this, and with nothing with it, just the butter. A little extra butter that's in the pan still. And ready to eat. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please remember to hit that subscribe button if you have not done so, and the bell icon so you know when the next video comes out. Also, please comment down below what you thought. I really appreciate it. You have a great rest of your day. And I will talk to you in the comments.